bring a smile to your face. Spring travel bargains. Yeah, the weather, the snow, the rain. We want to get away. We have some tips from Boston to Tahiti, some of the best bargains around. We'll yeah, tell you all about travel's it. Travel's great. Traveling on a bargain, even, <laughs> even better. Even better. Well, coming up, how does this sound, Chris? A trip to Tahiti. Uh, with all Sounds that very good. It's one of our spring travel bargain destinations. We'll tell you more. Yeah, next. weather's bad here. It looks great there. <laughs> You're watching the early show here on CBS. That looks very good, as a matter of fact. It sure does. Well, spring is almost here, and lots of folks would like to get away from it all. Oh, that sounds great. With a trip to somewhere fun, interesting, and maybe even a bit exotic. But travel, you know, can be very expensive. So Ann Vanis of SmartTravel.com is here with five bargain destinations for spring. Good morning, Ann. Nice Good to morning. see you. Good morning. Nice to see you, too. Yeah, because travel's expensive, and, yep. you know, you want to look for those bargains. So let's start off with... Costa Rica. Okay. Why is Costa Rica a bargain destination right now? Well, believe it or not, the best time to go to Costa Rica is when it rains. That might seem a little strange to some people, but it's the time to see the lush green scenery, and it's the best time of the year to find deals. What kind of deals do you get? Well, you can get to San Jose, Costa Rica for about $300 round trip from many departure points in the U.S., and once you're there, Hotel rates in spring will be about 20 to 25 percent cheaper than during the winter dry season. Another one of your tips is interesting, Washington, D.C. Now, does that have anything to do with the campaign 2008? One would think, yeah. Uh, 2008, obviously a big election year, so all eyes are going to be on the district. But spring is an ideal time to go. Yeah, we have, of course, and I lived in D.C. for many years, something might, people might not know is the Cherry Blossom Festival, which is coming up. Right. The, the annual Cherry Blossom Festival is starting at the end of March, and it's also great for families because there's a lot of free events that are in conjunction with the festival, like um, street events. There's also great fireworks. The Smithsonian is also having a kite festival, so kids can enter their kite in a competition or go to a workshop and learn how to build kites on their own. Of course, and all the monuments are free to see. It's always free. Always free, which is very nice. Absolutely. Another good family friendly destination you say is Boston. Why is that and, and why now? Well, Isn't it still cold in Boston? <laughs> I, I have to say I am from Boston so I can't lie. Right. Spring comes a little, a little bit, bit later. later. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. But the good thing there's a lot going on in the city and there's it's a perfect time for deals especially for families. And what, what kind of deals uh, are you getting and what are kind of some of the sites that you can see? Well for instance there is a deal that's run by Hilton and it's a school vacation package that's running in April. So for $200 a family of four can stay plus Plus, they get tickets to the New England Aquarium and the IMAX Theater, so it's all packaged together really nicely. Now we get a little exotic, shall we? Tahiti. Let's do it. <laughs> is it really a bargain destination, or is it a relative bargain well, destination? Well, that's the thing. Not all bargains are created equal. Yeah, exactly. So at Smarter Travel, we call Tahiti a relative bargain. And while it's not dirt cheap, you can find exceptional value considering it's an exotic locale and you're traveling halfway around the Give world. Give me a sense of the numbers though. What are we talking about? What will it cost? Well, if you want just airfare, there's a deal right now from Air Tahiti that's $788 round trip from LA and New York, so both coasts get to benefit. That's great. Now, we also have on here Spain. Now, obviously, it is incredibly expensive right now to travel throughout Europe, so why does Spain make it on your bargain destination list? Well, despite the Euro, Spain is an excellent option. Uh, right now, for spring airfare, they're running about $500 round trip, plus there's a lot of things going on in Spain. They just changed their um, rail infrastructure, so a lot of high-speed service. It's easy to travel within Spain, and the Prado, which is a famous museum in Madrid, they've expanded, doubled in size, and they're featuring uh, tons of exhibits on famous painter Goya throughout the whole, um, the whole spring this year. Just 30 seconds left. What's the best piece of advice, you know, for a family trying to think of where to go? You obviously have these tips. What's the best piece of advice to get those bargains? The best? If you really want to get the top bargains, you need to compare. Don't just go to one airfare state. Check out a whole bunch and see where you can get the best deal. All right. I wish we were all taking a trip right now. I know, right? <laughs> Especially raining today. Maybe we will. Ann Vanis, thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Great Thanks. to have you.